it's a great, you know, the best way to get around downtown Detroit. Best kept secret around. I was just saying to my mom, you know, before we got on, I was like, you know, you're, you want to go on the roller coaster? Because that's all kind of the Peep Mover really is. It's kind of just a roller coaster. And if you want to just do a quick, warm 45 minute architecture tour of downtown Detroit, you hop on the Peep Mover. And it's only 75 cents. You can't even take a taxi for 75 cents to the other side of downtown. Because, like, I love the thing. Like, how many other monorails do you see in, you know, major cities across the country? Not much. Right, yeah. So, like, I want them to make sure that the you know, they find ways to make the people mover way more effective, you know, or an option even. You, you know. can get on this puppy and just pretty much make the loop. Like I stay at Riverfront, so it's very convenient for me. I get a Riverfront and just about any place I want to go, I can do another people mover for a downtown, you know, resident and people that work downtown. It's the best, like, that's why I said it's the best kept secret because people that's not from around downtown, they don't really, they don't really utilize it. It's with the people mover, I know that you know, I can get on right here and take it all the way to Greek Town, and you know, it'll never change on me. It's very reliable. Um, as a resident in an apartment building who can hear it go by, uh, the timing is like clockwork. You know, every seven minutes it'll be by. If nothing happened on the, on the line or whatever, it's, it's perfect. Nine times out of ten, pretty good. Uh, so far, it's nice. Uh, it's a good addition to the city. It's really convenient. A lot of people work downtown, and there's uh, limited parking in Detroit, especially downtown. So, I think more more services like this is needed in order to um, connect the city with the downtown part of the city. Um, again, there's not a lot of parking, so people can park uh, in a way parking structures and you know catch the people mover in a queue line to different restaurants. We got a Texas Brazil down here. Um, it's real nice. When I moved downtown, I sold my car because it's almost like 200 a month to get a parking spot near my apartment. So it was honestly the best idea was just rely on the buses, the queue line, and the people mover. I would definitely say the fast bus is the best for sure because you can just take it so far. The last stop is um, in Auburn Hills on the border of Lake Orion, and you can, t and I think the Gratiot one goes all the way to um, New Baltimore. Baltimore and you can take the Michigan to the airport. So definitely the fast buses for sure. One of the things that does is help businesses along the Woodward Corridor bring in tourists who uh, are looking to use transit to get a little, to get around uh, this stretch of Woodward um, instead of relying on their personal vehicle. So you can park, find yourself the nearest queue line station, and within 15 minutes or so, we uh, we try to be. Uh, we tried to be there to pick up passengers and be on our way.